Hey everyone, welcome to a new episode of my Mega Park. In the last episode, I made this uh, jungle cruise ride, and the episode before that, I did this haunted mansion. And yeah, there's still quite a lot uh, of scenery I have to add to this area, especially near the blue coaster. Uh, what I want to do in this episode is uh, make the speed boat ride that I was talking about. Uh, so yeah, basically I want to have a speedboat that uh, goes through the through the water here, through the swamp uh, and just take a tour around this uh, coaster and give the guests some nice uh, views and then uh, finally return back to the station and while I'm building this ride uh, I also just want to fill in some of these uh, areas that are still a little bit too uh, empty so yeah, still got a lot of to, lot to do this episode. So uh, let's get started. Alright, I've made the track for the speedboat right now. Uh, I will make the track invisible later, but uh, now I will just show you how I made it. So here you see one of the trains. Um, most of the track has uh, chain lifts on it, just uh, to make the coaster faster. I set the chain lift to 32 kilometers per hour. Um, here in the middle, uh, I disabled the chain lifts for a bit. And here you can see this uh, water section. Um, basically, what I wanted here was uh, for the boats to go uh, to slowly pass uh, by this loop, just to give uh, the guests a nice view of it. And also, they will uh, pass uh, back uh, next to the loop and next to the uh, other track. So here they will still go uh, quite gently in between the, the loop and the lift hill of this coaster. And right after that, they will uh, go around this island again, under this bridge, under another bridge. And here at the end, uh, I put some more water sections just to uh, slow down the trains here. And then finally, they will be uh, gently rolling into the station again. So yeah, I think now is a good time to make the track invisible. So yeah, I kind of like how the boats actually uh, still bank through the through the turns here. That actually helps to make it look a little bit faster, I think. All right, uh, what I will do now is uh, add trees and plants all along the shore here, and also uh, fill in some of the missing pieces here. So yeah, that will that will probably cover most of the rest of this episode. Um, by the way, 
I also made some parts here, but these parts are just temporary. Uh, I had a lot of guests bunching up here who were trying to get to the jungle cruise. Uh, and they weren't able to find it, probably because of the high amount of junctions between this spot and this spot. So, um, therefore I made these temporary paths. Um, this tempor temporary path over here, I will make it a little bit more permanent. And then we also have a nice spot for the station of the speedboat ride. Alright, I really like the way this uh, shoreline looks, um, why this, making this takes a lot of time. Um, so um, in order to not get completely bored of it, I'm now going to continue on the station and then after that I'm going to continue doing the shoreline over here.
Alright, that's another part of the shoreline done. Now for this episode, uh, I will just uh, finish this shoreline over here. Just add a lot of trees and plants to it. And that will be the end of this uh, episode. It's already getting quite late, so I should go to bed soon. Now, at this part, uh, I won't add too many trees. Uh, I won't make it the plants too high, because I want the guests to have a few of the corkscrews here. Uh, the guests are actually watching the speedboat ride uh, sometimes over here. So when they do that, I want it to look like they're actually watching the corkscrews. Alright, that's uh, enough building from me for today. So yeah, today's extension was not too big, but uh, at least we finished up some uh, previously unfinished areas. So yeah, I made this area here with the station for the speedboat ride. And of course I made the speedboat ride which travels all throughout the swamp here. And uh, we finished up some of these uh, shorelines here, just to make the area all come together a bit more. Of course, we still need to finish this area under the coaster, but that will be for a later episode. Anyway, um, yeah, like I said, that was all building uh, from me for today. Um, now we will just follow one of these boats throughout the course, and that will be the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed watching me build, and I'll see you again in the next one. See you later.